And in honor of our 40th season, it is time for another Lawmakers Flashback. Tonight, the House debates a bill to prohibit the sale of gasoline below cost. Keep an eye peeled for <laughs> Representative Steve Thompson. This one is from 1985. The bill will prohibit the sale of gasoline below cost, specifically in retail service stations owned by refiners or wholesalers. This little independent guy that I have up the street from me that sells gas to me, and how can he sell to me cheaper than this guy over here, the refiner on a retail facility? Because he's buying in mass volume from a single source. The bill would require where whoever supplied the gasoline to sell on the same level of distribution in the same geographic area with same quantities at the same price. Now what this bill says is that if you are a farmer, you cannot sell to the general public from your roadside stand at a lower price than you sell to the A&P down the road. Isn't it a fact that what you're saying would be true if it weren't for the fact that three or four entities in this country control the supply of the product. In that competition, those entities only have 10% of the stations, only have 20% of the marketplace. But they, isn't it true they have all the product, though? What do you mean by all the product? All the gas. <laughs> gas only comes from one place, underground. They are gradually, within 10 or 15 more years, going to totally control the market like they do in Europe now. And gas in Europe, I suggest to you, is 3 to $4 a gallon. And they are controlling the market, those same big oil companies. If they control the marketplace, then they'd have more than 20% of the market right now. They've been in business for years. After considerable debate, SB 108 passed 127 to 37 with an amendment. It then moved back to the Senate. Representative Steve Thompson became a state senator in 1990 and still serves in the legislature. This has been a Lawmakers Flashback.